what's up guys we are back finally in uh american arcadia and i will have to say this game has been really good and we're here finally for chapter three now i don't remember how many chapters this game has but thus far it's been very interesting and a lot of fun so we will continue to play through see how it goes and maybe we can get out safely in the meantime make sure you guys like the video make sure you guys are subscribed for more and remember this will be unedited gameplay will be on patreon if regardless let us continue this playthrough i've been waiting to play it i've been enjoying this and i've been looking forward to the mystery that is this game and see what other puzzles that they try to cheap us out of so let us get started oh finally you're gonna make it yeah looks like it i'm a bit scared to be honest what am i gonna find out there angela oh well uh the world outside is not that different, just more modern and uglier. Mm. Much of the technology you already know from here also exists out there. You know, shared cars, cleaning bots, flying drones, we have all those. We also have something like Adanet, but with no restricted content, of course. But I'll uh, uh, I guess Adanet is like the We internet. waste our lives looking at screens, but that's not too different from you guys, is it? Holy cow, if... They weren't planning to kill me. I'm not sure if there is even a reason to get out of here, the way you put it. <laughs> there is one really good reason to get out. You've lived all your life inside a gilded cage. And for the first time, you're going to be completely free. Yeah. That is a valid point. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. That is important. All right. Remember to wear your access badge at all times. We got it. Are we six? I forget. <laughs> Please keep moving. It's been a while. Something bad has got to happen. There's no way that this goes uh, the way it should. I will have to say the backgrounds, the backdrops are actually pretty amazing. Everything was going fairly well, all things considered. Uh huh. I thought I was really close to getting out, but of but course... I didn't know about the jingle back then. The jingle? What? Do you do you hear that noise, by the way? It sounds like like an air raid siren in the distance or something. It's really annoying. Huh, no, I don't hear anything. Really? It's pretty loud. Don't pay any attention to it, Trevor. Just get through the checkpoint and leave. Remember to wear your access badge at all times. Jesus, that sound right, sir, is please. unbearable. Keep going, Trevor. We're really close. You'll be in a train outside Arcadia in a few steps. Next, please. Oh, are they... Are they playing something loud that only the people of Arcadia can hear it or something? I'm I'm not feeling too well. Trevor, Trevor, come on, move. <sighs> it was a nightmare. Take the worst headache and the worst dizziness you've ever had, smash them together, multiply them by 10, and you still wouldn't come close. Then the security guy says to me, Next, please. But I couldn't move. And if that wasn't enough, Angela says to me in the earpiece... Trevor, Trevor, come on, move. I can't take a step. I just can't. Are you feeling all right, sir? Yes, I just need a... <sighs> Security, please, come immediately. We might have a breach at gate B in lane 15. Uh-oh. And then I see a six foot tall guy with a menacing look come up to me and say, Subject 10392 clear text Trevor Hills. Uh -oh. You are violating the Burbank Act. Title 2, Section 11. Unauthorized exit attempt from an enclosed or restricted area. Uh oh. No, 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 no. You are no, also Trevor. violating Get the, the hell Burbank out of there Act. now. Title There's seven, no seven, use. Seven, I can't. <sighs> Listen, if you can't move forward, then go back. But you gotta move now. Trevor, do what I say, Goyo. 10392, stay right where you are. Subject 10392 is attempting escape. Initiate interception protocol. Interceptors, get the subject now. Uh. I couldn't believe it. 
Until then, Interceptors were an urban legend. A high-tech security force in Arcadia with a really cool sci-fi codename. It all started with the infamous leaked Arcadia 6 picture, you know? That one that Walton Media has always denied to be true. Mm. The guy in the back was believed to be an Interceptor. Okay. Most people just referred to him as the Tackleberry because he looked like that guy from the Police Academy movies. You know, helmet, sunglasses, leather jacket, and all that. Yeah, I get it. Anyway, I had worked in Walton Media for eight years, and I never saw or heard a thing about those guys. As I said, it was just an urban legend. Until now. Because the Interceptors were real. And they really looked like Tackleberry. <laughs> and they were chasing Trevor, who now had to run a 100-meter dash while feeling like complete shit. Yeah. Let's go. 392. Stop running. Yeah, they're definitely playing Angela. something. Angela. What? Yeah, I'm feeling better. Yeah, yeah, I'm feeling better. I did not see that. That's good news, but what save your breath. You Keep see running. Now. Wait, what? Oh, it's because I got held up. Please. Okay. 10392. <gasps> Stop running. Angela. Angela. I didn't see the thing. What? Yeah, I'm feeling better. Yeah, yeah, I'm feeling better. There we go. We have more distance. Oh, you can see now. Keep running. What? Ah! Interceptors on the tail of subject 10392. Great. Gotta run! Why do, why do these guys keep calling me 103? It's 103 something. It's your citizen ID. But what? This is no time for questions, damn it. Just run. Okay. Yeah, get out the way. Wait, what? I saw the camera was, oh, that's right. I forget, I control Trevor and the camera. Oh, I see what I was supposed to do, okay. Some type of hypnotic music that only Arcadia citizens can hear. Maintain pursuit. Okay, now we're good. We're golden. Do it, 10392. Ah! Oh lord. Subject is heading back to the station. Interceptor unit B. Proceed. Shit, they're coming from the escalators. Hey! I see the subject. Come on, Proceed come on. Oh, I didn't see that. I was looking at the Shit, camera thing. 10392, stop this nonsense and surrender. Back, 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 now. Back, back. Come on. And now what? Don't let something 10392 the boy. Find that uh, horrific statue or whatever that is. Okay. Just go back and forth. Just running man this. Some of us is not fit. You're doing pretty well, Trevor. Oh, we're going to traffic. Oh, this is gonna be lovely. supposed to interact with like frogger actually made it 
Oh, I was supposed to just see him. I thought I had to interact with something. <sighs> My body Bro. wasn't ready for this obstacle course. What just happened back there, Angela? I, I couldn't move with that noise. I don't know, man. I wasn't expecting that. I... Look, I have an idea. Angela, Blue Fountain Mall is right there. I used to spend a lot of time in there when I was a kid. Mall? Are you sure that that's a... Looks like I don't have much of a choice anyway. True. Yeah, yeah, you're, yeah, you're right. Okay. Guess we're going to the mall. Yeah, there might be places to hide as long as people don't see us. Hey, help me with that door, Angela, would you? Yeah, just a second. What the? Trevor, oh, snap! Shit. They've locked my computer. I, I, I don't know what, uh... Oh, hey, Gene, yeah. Yeah, yeah, me too. I, I can't do a thing. What on Earth? What, who are you talking to? Lockdown? Really? Uh, what happened? Ooh, that's bad. Okay, I'll see you in the lobby then. Yeah, I'll, they'll tell us how to proceed. <laughs> oh, she's right, locked out. Chico. I gotta find another place where I can connect and, and... Don't worry, Angela. Take your time. I'll be safe in the Skyrocket Arcade. Wait, wait, wait. You plan to hide inside an arcade? Not inside the arcade. They have a covered sit-down Spectrex cabinet there. That's where I plan to hide. I can play that thing for hours on just one quarter. Whatever suits you, man. I'm buying whatever you got right now. No problem. <laughs> buying whatever you got. Okay. Wait, do I gotta play a mini game of some sort? Or probably just a stall tactic while we play her. Oh, here it is. I'm at the Spectrex cabinet. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine in here. Okay, Trevor, just stay inside the cabinet until I'm out of here. I'll be back as soon as I... Hey, Kendra, what's up? This is a message for all Walton Media employees. Due to an unexpected breach of security, we have proceeded to activate the lockdown protocol. When called by your last name, please come immediately to the building entrance for all your digital devices to be scanned oh, for security snap. reasons. Thank Can you. you believe it? Yeah, someone's escaping from Arcadia. That's, that's really crazy. And an insider is helping him, one of us. They get the chance to work for Walton Media in the greatest achievement that has ever happened in entertainment. Uh -oh. And they want to boycott it? Because uh, why? Yeah. Yeah, right. I mean, the other things Walton did are okay, but between you and me, Angela, black and white movies, cartoons for kids. But American Arcadia? There is nothing like it. Others have tried to replicate it to create something like this. They got reality shows instead. But this is no reality show, Angela. American Arcadia mm. is the most advanced sociological experiment ever conducted. It has changed the way we perceive society and even... <laughs> is everything okay? Mm -hmm. huh? Uh, yes, it's... <sighs> I really have to get going, Kendra. I hope everything is solved by tomorrow morning. You know, right? Okay, see ya. Wait, what was, was that? Oh, the la boca, ya. She was repeating the same corporate bullshit she gave me on the first day on the 21st floor. Okay, preserve my admin permissions. Preserve my admin permissions. Jesus H. Christ, how am I going to do that? All cloud services will be monitored, so I can't upload it to the cloud. Okay, uh, what else then? I think that come was. On, the come on, come on, Angela, think. Breakout people. Gotta come up with something. And suddenly, that Architects of Tomorrow episode just pops into my head. Steganography, a word that comes from combining the Greek term steganos, which means covered or hidden, and graphos, which means writing. Huh? Let's take a look at this image behind me. Oh. Probably won't distinguish anything, but if we see the image through our red lens, everything in it suddenly makes sense. And that's what steganography basically is. Concealing a message within another message, or, as we've just seen, 
an image in another image. Mm. There are many examples of how to hide a code in an image, a text, or even a song. Who knows? Maybe this song has a secret message encoded in it, too. Because, as you can see, steganography is science. And as we know, science always finds a way. Okay. But how are we supposed to do that? If you have a secret and don't want to reveal it, steganography can be used to conceal it. And that's the lesson we've learned today. Because science always finds a way. I got it. I need to convert my admin permissions into hexadecimal code and then hide it in a non-digital source. Huh? A sequence of images. Hmm. Any VHS tape will do the trick. Okay, and I'm supposed to just find a VHS tape. Okay. So I can't go that way. Cafeteria? Oh, recording studio. Can I even go in here? I can. I'm feeling I'm not supposed to go in there right now. What's this way? Of course, as all gamers, try to go to a place we don't need to go to. try to go to the recording studio. I have the feeling that uh, for some reason the game's going to make me go back to the cafeteria, but let's go here. Karsten Saab. Please exit through the lobby door. Okay. Studio. Video editing. This is the video editing room. I gotta get in there to encrypt my cell phone data. Ah, I see, I see. The first two letters in our ID indicate our first and last names. Mine is A.S. They're calling the S's now. E.B. 21, blah blah must be long gone for sure. Okay, so I gotta find their card. No, don't scan it. Okay. Whoa, ZW. <laughs> I bet this guy will be the last exit the building. Okay. Can I find... Oh, they're probably like in the cafeteria. Maybe I gotta swipe their, uh... Steal their cards or something? So ZWEB. Okay, what about here? No. Uh, who is this guy? I barely know any employees on the first floor. It doesn't matter anyway. This guy's last name begins with a D. I'm sure he's not in the building anymore. Yeah, they're doing S's. All right, so yeah, I think I do have to go to the cafeteria. Huh, there must be a way to enter the editing room from the other side. Oh, from the studio, I see. For the storage room. All right, E, B, Z, W. This girl has pink hair. And C, D, white hair, okay. Good, good. Now I need to find Zeus Washington, Zeke Wasabi, or whatever this guy is and clone his ID. Fernando Salcedo. Uh-oh. We're waiting for you in the lobby exit. Okay. Not this guy. It's this. Wait, what? Let me clone your ID real quick. Yep, that's CW. And it's done. I'm not proud about doing this to a Walton Media coworker, but. I really needed your credentials, Zazu Waluigi. Waluigi. <laughs> Tiffany Schneider. How's it possible for Come a media to company to do these awful corporate videos? Well, I lucked into finding the guy. Okay, I'm trying to see if there's any other data I can take while I'm in here. 
I don't think I'm technically timed. I think it's tied to events. Okay. Unless the people are hanging out. Yeah, screw it. Let's just go. Right, find something in the storage. What in the world? How do I get to the video room? Whoever's in charge of keeping this area clear is doing an awful job. That was a lot of stuff. Dang. Dude, why is the music all ominous now? It's gonna be some puzzle of some sort. Or oh, is this? Oh, this is literally a maze. <laughs> okay. All right, sure. Jeez, this looks like a damn maze, and I hate mazes. It is. I was trying to see if there was something I can. Oh, I can duck down, right? There we go. Yep. And we're golden. Seymour. Seymour? Seymour Seymour. Very funny. Who's a wise ass? This is where I'm supposed to go, but I want to make sure there's nothing. Oh, I'm. I'm sorry. I. I uh, feel I hate this place. Seymour, Seymour. Seymour. I thought someone was joking with him when it was actually true. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anything hidden, so. Where do I go now? Carol, I, I got this. I know where I'm going. That tattoo oh, would be important I hope this later. Works. I hate squeezing into tight spaces. Rakim Sharp. Come to the lobby exit. This is a small recording studio for AA short stories and things like that. Not for the live feeds, of course. Lady Vivian would never lower herself to come down from her spire penthouse to record in here. Oh, she's in the spire. That's good to know. Anything back here? Signal. Okay. Come to the lobby exit. Okay, so how to encrypt? Okay, this Comet VHS will do the trick. Mira, está en español y todo. Okay. Hours and hours of useless TV footage. I don't know what this sound mixer is for, but I'm sure I don't need it. Oh, I thought that was where I was supposed to go. Oh, insert tape. Got it. So, let's get down to business. The blue screen shows the Comet Tape digital data. And the large monitor displays the admin permissions on my cell phone, which I need to hide. So I need to find the matching cell strings on both screens and then run a macro to hide my data inside the VHS tape. Huh? This ain't what you want, bitch, I'm a fucking phenomenon. Phenomenon, phenomenon, phenomenon. 